Ladies and gentlemen, we've been bringing you news of the SS Happiness excursion steamer, which left New York City yesterday morning for Coney Island, but has not returned. U.S. Coast Guard cutter Cuyahoga has been sent in search, but as yet no report has been received. Two points to starboard, Mr. Stevens. Aye, sir. Keep her head in the fog bank there. We can lose any ships after us. Stand by. We're coming aboard to investigate. Investigate? What are they going to investigate? Just keep going. Lights out. Lights out all over the ship. Fog's lifting, sir. Quick, quick of the wheel, Stevens. Take her four points to port. Hurry. Aye, sir. The cutter's put out a dory full of men. Boarding party. By gad, I haven't forgot how to handle pirates. Bates, will you fight? Oh, yes, sir. Will you fight for happiness? Are you with me? Of course I am, Captain. Okay. 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 Well, I ain't used these guns since the old Rachel Emery, but I kept them for a time like this. Yes, this, this one here, it, it ain't much use. It seems to kick and stick most of the time. Uh, it, 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 it just don't go off at all. I'll take this one if you don't mind, Captain. Stop your engine. What's this? There she blows. They shot a warning cross. Cross our bow. Aye, Papa, you think you're so smart. They have got guns, too. Uh, they're no better than Rusty Morgan's buccaneers coming up here like this. They'll be trying to stove our ship in next. Open up. Open up that wheelhouse. Don't, Don't let him in. in. Oh, we'll never reach that island. You get away from here. I don't want to go back to that laundry. All right. All right. Put down those blunderbusses and speak up. Who's pulling off this shindig? I am the captain of the SS Happiness. And what in blazes is the idea going around in circles all night? Well, we're so dizzy chasing you again. Circles? Circles? You mean I ain't at sea? I'm still in, in the New York Harbor? You're a menace to navigation. Go below with the passengers. Look, Papa, we're almost home. Hi, Mama, Mama, those islands. Huh? Yeah, wait. It hurts to bring you back like this, mates. Mm -hmm. But let our white and gold ship come sailing into the harbor again, bearing on her decks a new crew of men and women, topsails shining in the morning sun, and innards blazing with the spirit we found last night out there. And our excursion will mean something. Take courage and vision back with you. Fight for the things you want back there. Fight like you fought for the faraway island last night. Be men and women armed with love and wonder, and make life a glowing thing. Will you do that? Gee, look at all the people. No one was ever so glad to see me before. Uh, just look on Brooklyn. My, ain't it nice, Captain, huh? Captain, it's just come over the radio. The company says it's going to keep the happiness going next year. You mean they ain't going to make a garbage scow out of it? The whole city's been calling up wanting to go on a trip like this. So they're not going to junk her. Well, bless oh, me. Oh, is that sweet? Bless yes, me. Thank you, Mitch. Thank you. Yeah. You ain't going to use that dirty old subway next year, are you? No, sir. You'll just come aboard the SS Happiness for a nice, quiet trip. Huh? Nice day, Mr. Stephen. Yes, sir. Sun up high and bright. Ha <laughs> ha. That's the way I like it for me passengers. And I've been thinking, Mr. Stevens, they said I was going to be captain of this ship next year, uh, didn't they? Aye, sir. That's what they said. Uh, and don't you see, Mr. Stevens, me mate, uh, I got another chance to try it again. I, I might get there next year. That was magnificent, Walter. We always get a thrill out of your fine performances. And here's Connie Boswell again with a song about last night. It's a new ballad, and I think you'll more than enjoy it. Go ahead, Connie. Last night I touched your pain And when I touched your lips, I fell in love, bless my Last night, I felt your heart beat fast. Swiftly the moments passed, 
question that's just as pertinent as it is timely. Tell me, ladies, what would you say if you discovered the coffee you bought this morning had already lost half the precious flavor and goodness you paid to enjoy? Well, I'd say I didn't get my money's worth. But, Mr. Hull, can that actually happen to the coffee I buy? It certainly can. Because of this one important scientific fact, air steals away coffee flavor. All coffee, ground or in the whole bean, starts to lose flavor as soon as it's roasted, if exposed to the air. In fact, ground coffee, packed in ordinary containers where air can easily reach it, loses as much as 45%, nearly half its precious flavor, in only nine days. That's mighty important for any housewife to know about the coffee she buys. But how about Maxwell House? Well, we think too much of this superb new Maxwell House blend to let one bit of its wonderful flavor and goodness escape. That's just why we take Maxwell House, still fresh and fragrant from the roasting ovens, and pack it in the familiar blue super vacuum can. No air can get in, so no flavor can get out. Maxwell House comes right into your kitchen with a full measure of fresh flavor and fragrance sealed in. None wasted. Yes, that's one of the outstanding values in every pound of Maxwell House coffee. One very good reason why Maxwell House gives you, Mrs. Consumer, so much for your money. So if you want more flavor per cup and more cups of full-flavored coffee per pound, try a pound of the new Maxwell House tomorrow. You'll be getting wonderfully richer, more delicious coffee that's not just days fresh, but roaster fresh. And no coffee can be fresher than that. <laughs> 